Yeah. So, yeah, he's going to be there with the cowboy hat and everything. Big black cowboy hat. You got it. There That's you his go. Thing. Tim McGraw. All right. All right. So it's going to be great. It's going to be. You okay over there? I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> you almost had a $50,000 fine. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Get my knee. Ouch. All right. So there we go. He has a whole set of uh, number one hits that he's going to go through. So I'm a fan. Big, fan of, big fan of Timmy. All right. All right. All right, so we did not get any takers for this open mic singing contest. I have a plan B, people, so don't uh-huh. you even worry. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. I have a plan B. But since we didn't get our open mic singing contest, I did say that I was going to have a karaoke moment, and I'm going to mimic <laughs> Marilyn since she's gracing Michigan Avenue. Uh, boy, what a sight that people will see. And we're going to go ahead and, and dedicate it to the person who commissioned her her statue. Let me just make sure we're rolling tape on this. And then okay. this will be Paul Zeller, uh, president and CEO of Zeller Realty Group. This one's for you. <laughs> no, here we go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Mr. President Paul Zeller. Happy birthday to you. Wow. Oh my gosh! <laughs> and we we should sell that audio. Oh right there. my goodness! We need to sell it. Uh, maybe he has a birthday. <laughs> you know, hey, play it at your party. I like it. Okay. <laughs> well, not sounding anything like this lady. All right, all right. Of course, we're referring to Miss Patty LaBelle. Of course, she was just honored at the BET Awards. I think we had talked about it a few we weeks did. ago. Yeah, she received this huge honor uh, from uh, the folks over at BET. And, uh, you know, when they honor folks like that, um, they they go through and pick some of their big hits and, and, and choose some current mm-hmm. artists to sing the song as a tribute to them. So it was really nice. And so, you know, if, if you had Jennifer Hudson in one hand and Patti LaBelle in the other hand, and they were both going to be in town on the same night, who would you go see? Me? Isn't well, Tim McGraw in, in town? Well, according <laughs> to see. this write-up, it's next yeah. Saturday. I'd probably go see, I'd probably go see Jennifer Hudson. Uh, n- nothing against Miss, uh, Miss LaBelle, but she was a little bit before my time. And, and Jennifer Hudson... You know what? You can say what you might want about American Idol, but that woman can sing. Mm-hmm. She has got one heck of a voice on her, I'm and uh, she does like a commercial for Weight Watchers, I think. Yes, she and does. and the so- and the song she sings is just it's so good. Mm-hmm. Just she can sing anything, and it'll sound great. So mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Hudson's got my vote. Well, the funny thing about these two is, uh, some years ago on another award show, uh, P- Patti LaBelle was again honored. And Jennifer Hudson sang her song. Mm-hmm. Um, it really, it's not Patti LaBelle's song. It's a song that, um, um, <laughs> I don't know where you're going. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Brain Free, Somewhere Over the Rainbow. Oh. Who, the, the first artist who, who uh, put it on the map. Uh, in, the, in the movie. In the movie. Why can't I think of her name? Anyway. Good Lord. Yeah, now, um, now you're killing me. Yeah, I'm but anyway. Uh, Patti LaBelle redid the song some years ago and just gave it a life of its own. And so... Um, Judy Garland. Judy Garland, what is wrong with <laughs> me? Yes, Judy Garland. Okay, Somewhere Over a Rainbow. Okay, Patti took the song, revamped it, and just blew it out. Um, and so a few years ago, maybe five years ago, when they did this tribute to her, uh, Jennifer Hudson sang it. Um, and sh- boy, you thought Patty blew it out the box. You just said what an awesome voice Jennifer has. 
she even did a better job with it or, you know, at least equal, um, an equal job. So who do you go see? Well, Patty is going to be at the Horseshoe Casino at the venue, which is in Hammond, Indiana, 730 tonight. Hmm. And tickets range from 60 to $95. I go to Ticketmaster for those. And Jennifer is going to be at um, Ravinia tonight and tomorrow night. And uh, same thing. You, well, you can go to Ravinia.org for that information. So I don't know what people are going to decide to do. <laughs> That's a tough one, uh-huh. you know. And for all I know, my, I'm reading this wrong. I don't know. My comprehension isn't functioning <laughs> well, so... Don't be mad at me if it's next weekend and I'm saying this. <laughs> Do your own weekend. research. <laughs> Do your own research. But anyway, you, what, a, what a weekend. Tim McGraw, Jay Hud, and Patti LaBelle all in town on the same night. Take a break. Yeah, we can do okay, that. Okay, we'll take a break. And I'll tell you what, we'll keep the phone lines open if you've decided that, you know, after hearing my rendition of the Happy Birthday song, <laughs> that you can do a way better job than that. We Call may us play up. that again. 815-254-7300. <laughs> 